What is up guys, give him chills here. Welcome back to another video, just tutorial, quick tutorial on how to do, uh, how to do that. Today I'm gonna be showing you how to get punched on stream when people redeem points in your chat. Before we get started, if you want to see more of these, come to my stream on twitch.tv slash give him chills. There's a bunch of them. I have thug life, punching. And if you want more videos like this on how to integrate uh, channel points to trigger things on your stream and trigger actions above your camera or above your stream, please comment below that you want that and I'll make more videos like this. If not, just skip ahead and start watching. Let's get into it. All right, guys. So the first thing you want to do is you want to create a new scene that will have the camera under it and the video of the punching over your face. So we're going to go in here and say camera one and we're going to add that. The next thing you want to do is you want to add a source for your camera. So go in here. I'm going to add my existing camera. Now we have my camera. I'm going to adjust the size of the video to whatever I want it. Mine is not 1080 for some reason right now. This is the green screen video that we're going to be using to overlay the punching on the on the camera. I will leave this file on the bottom. You can go download it uh, and use it. It's free. There's no uh, copywriting or anything has to do with it what you want to do next is add another source and this source will be a media source this media source will be the punching video i'm going to say punching video add and what you want to do is you want to browse and go get the select the punching video that you downloaded and all these settings are stay the same you don't have to worry about it unless you want to like speed it up or slow it down you can do that we do not want it to loop because we want it to do it once it can become really annoying if it just keeps going on and now we added it you can see now that we've added it you can see it's still green screen the next thing you want to do is you want to right click on that video press on filters and then add a new filter that's a chroma key this chroma key will get rid of the green screen so because our screen, because our background is green, it's going to get the green screen. And now we can see once we deactivate and reactivate the punching video, it's going to punch me again. But now, so now that we have this in place, what we want to do is turn off the punching video and then go to the scene that we desire to have this camera in and inject this scene under it. So let's go do that. All right, in my scenario, I wanna inject my camera into here. So what we're gonna do is under sources, you're gonna come and add. And then when you press add, you wanna click on scene. So you wanna add a new scene. And this is the concept of nested scene, which I totally recommend doing because it makes OBS a hundred times easier to use. So you wanna do an existing scene and you wanna go find the camera one that you just created. So now we have my camera one. I'm gonna readjust the camera, right? So now it's fully readjusted so let's say i want to put the camera in here right so now i have my scene in here i have the punching video on it but it's not going to play because it's not going to trigger the next thing you want to do is we want to go to twitch we want to add a new channel point redemption that will say punch whatever name you want to name it and then put a price on it and then we're going to go into touch portal and set that up to trigger that toggle to turn on so it can punch me in the face all right, guys, so the next thing you want to do is you want to go to your channel on Twitch. You want to go to Creator Dashboard. And after you've gone to Creator Dashboard, you want to go to Community. Under Community, you'll see this tab called Channel Points. You want to click on that. You want to manage on manage rewards and challenges. Click on that. And then you'll see here all the current channel points redemptions that you have. What you want to do is you want to add a new custom reward. And you can name it whatever you want. So in my case, it's called punch in the face. So I'm going to call it punch in the face. Right. And I'm going to say this will cost 200 points. Uh, there's you can put a description if you want. You can make them say any text if you want. Upload your own icons. That's your own thing. And now that we have this, we want to create it. And you'll see that now we have punch in the face right here, ready to be used in our channel chat. The next thing that we're going to do is we're going to go and download touch portal and set it up to respect any time punch in the face is redeemed. It's going to trigger our punching in the face. All right, guys. So this is touch portal. The link will be down in the description while you're at it. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Uh, you want to come in here and go to the download section. I'm currently using windows. So I'm going to be downloading the windows edition. Once you've downloaded touch portal, go ahead and install it. Go press next, next, next. It's all going to be the same. Once you've installed Touch Portal, the screen is going to look something like this. Uh, this is Touch Portal is basically like Stream Deck, but more of like a digital edition. So you can use it on your phone. There's an iOS edition and there is an Android edition. 
Make sure you comment below if you want me to show a video of how to set it up where you can use it with your phone, trigger some actions that use your phone as a stream deck. I can do that as well. Uh, but the reason we're going to be using Touch Portal today is basically to listen to Twitch when a channel point is redeemed to punch you in the face that will trigger something in OBS that will punch you in the face. Tan, tan, tan. All right. The free edition of Touch Portal comes with eight boxes that you can use. Uh, you can upgrade to $13 and have as many as you want and have multiple scenes and all that. So in Touch Portal here, what you wanna do is you wanna click on this connection icon right here, connect with OBS. What this will do is open a WebSocket that will basically let OBS listen to Touch Portal. And what you wanna do is you wanna click one of these empty boxes, click on that, and then in our scenario, you wanna do an on event, not on press. Under on event, you're gonna go down all the way to the bottom, you're gonna see Twitch. Uh, the, the green batches are events basically and what you want to do is you want to do on channel points redeemed You want to click on that and in here you want to name it the exact same name that you named it in twitch So you go to your twitch channel and You go to the one you just did it. So you want to copy this name Copy that and go in here and basically paste it. So now touch portal knows that when this is triggered I want to do something right. So the next thing we're going to do is we're going to modify stuff in OBS under OBS, we want to basically toggle uh, visibility of a, of a source, right? So source visibility, we want to toggle the visibility of the punching video. So we're going to say touch visibility and we're going to basically show it and our, show it for the scene of camera one. We want to show punching video. So that will basically turn it on, which will start punching. What you want to do next is put logic in. And logic is just going to be a timer and the timer is going to be four to five seconds. That's how long the video is. We're going to say five seconds. And then what you want to do is you want to go back and add another source visibility toggle. And we're going to do hide. And then we're just going to say, turn it off. Uh, turn it off. So that will basically come in. Punch in the face is recognized by port touch portal. One important thing you want to do before you save is you want to put a name on the button text. If you don't not put a name on the button text, it will not save. So now that we have it in here, you can come. It's saved. Once the punch in the face is redeemed, we're going to show, wait, and hide. Let's go and test that. All right. So this is my channel. Make sure when you go to your channel, check out my channel and follow me. Uh, you want to go in here to test it. Go to chat. And then you want to basically click on your redemption point and you will see the new one that you just added. Punch in the face right here. You want to redeem it and voila, now you have punching the face on your camera happening right away. Um, so yeah, that's that sums it up basically. I mean, you can obviously adjust it, put more filters on it, put uh, speed, slow it down or whatever. But point being is anytime come, people come here, they can redeem now 200 of their points to do this. Aha. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this was helpful and I hope to see it on your stream. If you do, please leave your comment below. I'll come check it out and use it probably on your stream and give you a follow. Uh, again, thank you for watching. Please subscribe to the channel for more videos like this and let me know if you've enjoyed this. If you have any questions, you can join our Discord channel. Uh, I can answer any questions you have there on how to set up stuff like this. Uh, and we get to know each other, talk, play video games together. So please come check it out on twitch.tv slash give him chills. Join our server on Discord and subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching. Give him chills out. Thank you for watching so much and you have a good night.